Well, here we are, Sunday, 20th of March. Look at that for the sky. So today we are doing our Church Stretton ride. But we are going on from Church Stretton. We are heading to, now let me get this right, Cly, Cly Redog, Cly Redog, Cly Redog or Cly Redog Reservoir in Wales. So we've got a nice little ride, beautiful weather. I don't know how many's turning up, how many's coming. Filled the tank up yesterday. £30 to fill the tank on the bike. And then he passed out at the petrol pump. What a beautiful morning. Four degrees. I think the highest it's going to be today is about 10, 11 degrees. So it's not going to be mega hot. It's going to be nice. Good morning YouTube, lovely day for it. Off to the Long Minden Church Stretton. They made it junction free. At the Motor Rev HQ. Oh yeah, nice sunny day. I've still got my heated stuff on. Oh yeah, you know I've got my heated gerbin gloves on eat your jacket but I've messed up because of, oh yeah, I put my socks on so let's go meet up with the boys wow. where's he going in front oh my god man this lad is gonna kill me up lad we're now heading off to the motor of meeting point to meet the rest of them and yesterday I thought I'll fill the tank up while I've got the bike out doing it let me just check the tyre pressures front tyre was down to 29 should be 36 I thought that needs a bit of air in that's probably last time I checked it was about November so I put it in checked the back tyre the back tyre was on 9 psi and I thought that ain't right it shouldn't have lost that much from 42 to 9 I mean it's more or less a brand new tyre on the back so anyhow, I put up the centre stand, spun the wheel round and there we go. A nail in the back tyre. So I don't know when I picked that up, it must have been from the last time I went out, which I can't remember, was the last time. So I had one plug left in my puncture repair kit. I plugged it, I blew it up, went out for the afternoon, came back and it was fine, I hadn't lost any pressure checked it this morning and the same it hasn't lost any pressure so it all looks good what I'll do is throughout the day I'll still monitor it to make sure I've still got pressure and I thought why why does it always have to happen at the time when you're going for a ride I am the first it's not very often I'm only than goose but sometimes I am and today, I am. Here we go. We've got Nicky. And two. Good morning. How are we doing? Okay. Good morning. How you doing, son? Right. Are we in? She's a beauty, isn't she? Yeah. Yeah. Is it smooth as butter? Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Hey, everyone.
boys on the new bikes. Look at look at him go. Hey, dude, son. Right, yeah. You happy now? Oh, my. <laughs> hey, dude, son. I'll go right now. Are you so good to be on it now? Oh, yeah. I'll tell you what, that yellow looks good, that does. does With that black. Yep. You all right? You all right? Yeah, sound. You all right? Yeah. Oh, got a posse in town. You all right? I do. Here we go, we've got the biker guys, we've got Steve Muller, we've got the goose, we've got the rainbows over there. We've got a few bikes here. Right, our next stop is we need to go over to Wolverley to go and meet Mr Davis and then on to Church Stratton to meet the rest of the Piggies riders. So to get loaded up. I couldn't do the crap. The crash bars because I needed somebody on this side of the bike to hold the, it's a big bolt. Yeah. But it was spinning. Do you know what I mean? You got like it's a long gun that goes through. So I was trying to hold both, but I couldn't. I need somebody on this side to hold it and then leave with that one. But I just oh, I had a right game with these. Oh, you know what? I was having a bad day yesterday. Because <laughs> so you know, you know these. I put to yeah. change the hand guards and I put I haven't done that too far. I pulled it out and left the nut and the washer. You. So we had to make, I had to get another one and leave that one stuck in. You were not bad, didn't you? Yeah. I was fuming. I was recording it. <laughs> and I was getting proper mad. <laughs> I, was I, effing, I was effing and blinding. This is like not the right way to... Uh, I was like... <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll have to make a video out of it. <laughs> yeah, this is how not to fit hand guards. So really today is going to be your proper test of that bike, isn't it? Yeah. Like for a long ride. Yeah. And then I'll do a review on it, I think, uh, next weekend. I'll go out and just, like, do, like, like what the E done, that TMF. Yeah. Like, do, pull up somewhere and just blah, blah, blah. And I wonder if uh, Bear's in his mesh jacket. Aye. I wonder if Bear's got his mesh jacket on. Well, you know what? He come in it before and it was yeah. snowy, man. <laughs> it was even colder last time. Wow. So much better having this Ultimate Add-ons phone case here at the top mm -hmm. of my screen. I gotta keep putting my head down like that to look at it. Yeah, that's a good idea. I might try and actually. And again, fixed with a mighty Sioux group. Hey, how do you? Here he is, Mickey D. Jack Demas. Let's go. Are you ready to rumble? I'll tell well, you what though, if I hadn't have gone to fit up last night. I wouldn't have found that punch at all this morning. I know, that was just a bit of luck, worry. And I thought, yesterday, I thought, no. I thought, so there's no stress in the morning, I'll fit up yeah. tonight. I've got all, all, all the cameras was on the bike ready last yeah. night. That's a good job I did. It's a bit far for noodles to come, eh? Yeah. But he's coming, but say it's there, he's coming down to Albies for breakfast. I was we're only there. We're only there every hour. It might be that it's got some at on as yeah. well, Auntie. I think he has his kids, don't he? Oh, okay. Every alternative weekend. Oh, that's probably what it is. Because I think his wife left him for a better looking model. Oh, you can't blame him, can you? <laughs> <laughs> I says, uh, my mate, I says, noodles. I says, he's a taxi driver. I says, like, he does that, he works. I says, but he does that weekends, like, for some extra income. Yeah. And he says, oh, yeah, yeah. And he goes, um, so they picked up this woman, the one late at night, and um, turned around and says, I've been uh, reading a book about sex. And um, he says, oh yeah. He says, and it's a, a now fact that the Red Indians have got the longest penis and the Irish have got the thickest penis. I says, and by the way, my name's Sally. He says, what's your? <laughs> he says, Tonto O'Connor. <laughs> but it just tickled me. The funniest one was the prostate check. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. And that's only yeah. because you got it wrong. I know. 
It's because you know, I kept interrupting, you know, and <laughs> saying, did, 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 and, and taking a pee. I was trying to get it right. Yeah, I'm going to be due mine in, um, what is it, 50? You have that at done? 50, but I think I had mine done just before 50 because I was going there. At <laughs> you asked to have it done. <laughs> <laughs> no, I went and says, uh, I've got something wrong with my butt, can you have a look? And, uh, Did you say, yeah, that needs filling? The trouble is, though, that my doctor, he's got fucking hands like bananas. <laughs> Bunch of bananas, as my dad would say. <laughs> a bit scared. You know what, and this is true, I, I had the, that a finger up my ass when I was 20, about 21, because I was... <laughs> Uh, that, I was was having pro <laughs> that was nothing to do with the doctor. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want the doctor. <laughs> that was in the chippy. <laughs> now, um, I was having st uh, st like st stomach problems and that, and yeah. they just want, they want you, I don't even know it was like I was having that done. I did tr this is true, this is I got in the room. I had the camera down, me frowed, that big freaking camera. And then, before the camera down, I went in this room, and they says, uh, take your clothes off, just leave your your boxer shorts on. I says, yeah, okay. So we'll go on his bed, being young and naive. I don't even know what was going to happen. So I says, turn and look at the wall, bring your knees straight up, and this is true. It's really true, this ain't no joke or anything. And the nurse come and put her hand on my thigh. My knee, I says, bring your knees right up to your chest as far as you can go. Then I, the doctor come in, this bloke, I hear the glove. Tuck, tuck. You got that squirty bloody, not cream, <laughs> gel. <laughs> I hear that going, I thought, what's he going to do? And then he's, it's all right, we're just going to check down there. And I thought, check what? Next thing you know, he sticks his finger up my jacksie, right? And my legs straightened. And she says, you want I went, no, that's, I'm not even going to say the joke I usually say. But I tell you what, my legs straightened. And I got off the uh, bed after. I felt like I'd been raped. You know? <laughs> Oh my God, I was walking like John Wayne when I come out. You got off the bed and you was in a furniture shop. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh, you twataninus. Campsite, yeah? Well, that's I a lovely so. view, isn't it? Oh yeah, that's nice. Pre what's that? Pressed out uh, grains, that looks nice. Oh, what a lovely yeah. view. If you look at your right hips, it's compared to my, my, my tops of my thighs and virtually straight, you them down a bit, yeah. your legs kick back a bit. I could do with Honestly. pegs. I could do with them a bit there. Mm -hmm. That would be ideal. Yeah, the right, you can see the different riding position. I think you, you, like you can't get lowered pegs for these. I might look okay, at yeah. it. Yeah, it makes me knees ache. What Where the fire blade just made everything ache. It's mad, you know, you like change the bike and that bike feels great yeah. compared to the... But I, I couldn't go back to a sports bike. No way. Yeah. There's Bear! Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Beat him up. Cause... It's the... It's the Bear! Yeah, he got his mesh on, has he? <laughs> I don't know, just... He's, he's got it in his top box, just in case. I did hear him, I called him, I'll actually say. We were all turning up to meet. Do you know how to pay for car parking? Is that because there was Covid last time, do you think? I don't know. Remember when they were stopping us and says, uh, oh, you can't park here. Just pull it on the left. Get it on ground, bro. Let's just get round here. I'm going to come and mount it just now, I can feel it. Well, no, I did email him and say, we're going to park here, but we're then soon going to get off, as soon as we've met up. How did that? Yeah, yeah, I'll tell you what, I'll go down there, that way. I've got a bit of good ground here, so. There's Bear! Bear bollock. Still plugged in. Oh! I'm in Essen! 
Oh. Just waiting for Piggy. And the Piggy's riders to turn up. There's a few of us here already. So here we are. This is the bottom part of Cardin Mill. There's Church Stretton. That's where we go, over the top. But this is the little valley in the middle. So, so far we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. There's 30 bikes so far. I don't know how many piggy riders are coming. Summit's happened, or why needs another breakfast? <laughs> 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 